how Port Harcourt was founded. Ah, okay, Alistair has been excused. How Port Harcourt? Because uh, Port Harcourt is a river's boy. Uh, he once called the uh, Ogunpa River when he was posted to Ibadan to go and serve as a youth copper. Born in Bonny, he was born in Bonny. They sent him after graduating from the University of Port Harcourt to, to Ibadan to go. And he said, he asked people, where is that Ogunpa River that is killing people? And they pointed to, I said, this gutter, that this gutter under the Kau River. Anyway, what would you expect from a boy that was born on the Atlantic Ocean? Okay, how Port Harcourt was founded? In 1912, Port Harcourt was established by Frederick Lugard, who was the governor of both the Northern Nigeria Protectorate and the Southern Nigerian Protectorate. This was before amalgamation anyway. The port was built in 1912, but not given a name until August 1913, when it was named Port Harcourt in honor of Louis Harcourt, first Viscount Harcourt, then the Secretary of State for the Colonies and a very good friend of Lord Lugard, with whom the 1914 amalgamation was perfected against the advice of some in the colonial service and some educated natives like Shapara Williams. Its main purpose, and I repeat, its main purpose, the main purpose for founding Port Harcourt was to export the coal that was discovered in Enugu by geologist Albert Ernest Kisten in 1909. You see, the infrastructure they were providing in those days was were essentially for to get resources out here. The colonial government took over the land of the people of Diobu and construction of a port town began in the same year. Over time, other nearby villages like Oroworuko, Oromeru Zumbu, Mpogu, and Rumo Masi were absorbed into the city. The creeks to the south of the original port were inhabited by the fishing camps and grounds of the Wakirike Ijo group. During the First World War, Port Harcourt was used as a base for military operations against the Central Powers in German Cameroon. Then, in 1956, crude oil was discovered in Oloibiri and Port Harcourt exported the first shipment from Nigeria in 1958. That's when the city became the oil capital of Nigeria. The growth of Port Harcourt was also due to its position as a commercial engine room and foremost industrial city of the former eastern, eastern region. Its location in the Niger Delta and its significance as the center of social and economic life in River State after the Republic of Biafra seceded from Nigeria in 1967, Port Harcourt fell to Nigerian forces on 19 May 1968. The city expanded dramatically from 15.54 kilometers uh, kilometer radius in 1914 to 360 kilometer radius in 1980. I am Bola Oba.